What's up guys? Welcome back to another Clear Shot Golf video. I'm out here with my boy Rick today at the Foundry and we are going to play a 1v1 uh, match play match. Five holes, winner takes all. So, if you've never seen Rick before, welcome to the channel. Hey everybody. And let's get into this. Oh god, that's, that's one for the books. It's in play. No need to look for that one. Piped. Yeah, I think that'll work. Great ball. So after the first tee, uh, I'm in the fairway. Rick was a little bit left, but he's in play. So we're gonna go to his ball. I think he's going first. This is a, it's a pretty lengthy par four. It's one of the hardest holes on the course. So walking away with a four here is, is positive. Here's Rick's ball. We've got a little over 200 yards to the hole and he's got honors. The layup. All right, so my ball's in the fairway. I've got about 170 left to the green. I'm gonna hit a smooth six iron, try to put it close to the pin. Come on, catch a piece of that. Short. Not bad though, you've got an exposed pin. So we're both up here, neither of us hit the green, but that's okay. We got a couple easy looking up and downs, get this par, so let's go. I think Rick might be a little further out, but I'm not sure. We'll see if we get up there. Here's Rick with his approach shot. It's on the green. 20 yards to the hole. I'm just gonna take a smooth little 60 degree. Try to put it close. He's pretty tight, folks. Looks okay. So I got it in pretty tight here. That's what I'm looking at for my par. Rick's maybe got 25 feet for his par. Good roll. So Kelly's got about, looks to be about six feet to save his four. And I'm fairly certain he'll make it the way he's putted the last three holes. He's pretty much made everything when he needed to. And I think this one is gonna get me in some trouble here. Like I said, he makes it look easy. Great four. Well. I'm in for a four, Rick's in for five, so leaves me one up going into the second hole. The second hole, I think is the, shoot, so this is, this was the third hardest hole on the course. We're going into the fifth hardest, followed by the first hardest. So a pretty interesting uh, stretch of par fours, but I'm looking forward to it. Oh yeah, and I love getting beat. <laughs> Let's go. So coming up to the second hole in our match, this is a, 312 yard par four. It's short, but it's pretty tricky. The t bar or the, the green is very elevated at the end and it's very well protected by a handful of bunkers. So you kind of have to hit maybe like a 250 shot down there, wedge it up onto the green, which is pretty intense, and then, then try to sink it. But there's a reason it's one of the top five hardest holes out here. And uh, I got honors. Shot Tracer's really gonna like that one. Nice baby draw. That'll be fine. Good shot. Rick and I are, I think we're both in the fairway. He's gonna be on the right hand side, but it's okay over there. From the tee box, it looks like there might not be any space, but it's, it's fairly open. So let's see what we got. Getting up to Rick's ball. He is just on the right hand side, but I mean, he's got a good look at it. Just got to put it up over the, over the bunker. I'm a little left of him, so. Right side of the green. That works. Kelly with 105 to the stick. He's staring right at it. 
a little left of the pin, but great strike. And he's dancing. Great shot again. All right, walking up to Rick's ball. We're both on the green. Um, I'm down there, maybe 10 feet. Rick's got this little slider. Let's see. Let's see if you can make this work. Oh, it breaks so much. Sit down. So I'm about four and a half feet from my four. Kelly is putting for a birdie. He's got about, looks to be about 15 feet. Not bad. Left him about, I'll give you that if we're match playing it. Thanks, man. Good four. Now I've got to make mine. And I'm in for par. This is Rick to see if he can have the hole from maybe about four or five feet. It's a decent amount of break, but he's a great putter, so he's got this. Oh! Left it on the shy side. Jeez. So, after two holes in our five hole match, I'm uh, currently two, two up. Um, we're going into the first hardest hole on this course. So, see what we can do. This is the number one most difficult hole on the course. Uh, it's a hard dog leg right. You gotta carry it pretty decent off the tee to give yourself a shot at the green and then it's not a super long approach shot but it's bunkers everywhere, crazy green undulation. So let's just try to get it down there. Hold on. Man, you might have hit the perfect cut. I lost it. All right, here's Rick's ball. Flag is over yonder. He's got about 130 to the flag. And got a pretty good look. Nice looking ball, go. Ooh. She's tight. <laughs> she's tight. Yeah, I think he's in there pretty close. Solid shot by Rick. All right, here's my second shot. Legs over here. Ball's a decent amount below my feet, so we'll just try to put a good swing on it. Sure. No. Well, anything to say? <laughs> that was a bad swing. <laughs> a little thin in the bunker, but salvageable. I think Rick's in close. I had a terrible shot I'm right here in the bunker. Pins over there. It's gonna to be tough, but we're gonna get it on. Not a bad out from that lie. Deep, deep bunker. Could be a long putt, but let's hold it. All right, so here we are. Uh, I've got about 30 feet left. Rick maybe has two feet, so I've obviously got to go first. Um, this is for par, and he's got that for birdie, so if I miss this putt, then I'm just gonna concede his. Well, birdie for Rick is good enough to win that hole. Um, walking away with a five. So now I'm back to one up in the match with two to play. He's putting the pressure back on. Let's go. Okay, coming up to the fourth hole in our match. I'm currently one up after that really nice birdie from Rick. The hardest hole on the course. We are at a short par three. A little bit intimidating though, because there's water basically everywhere surrounding this green. So I think it's only playing about 145. Let's see if you can stick this close. Left side. Oh, that's so bad. Get out. Well, that wasn't the best of shots, so I have to drop. I went in the water. I don't know what happened. So, 
This is my third shot going to the green. Rick is just a little off to the left. Rick's laying one, I'm laying two, so gotta, gotta get this one in the hole. Great shot, great shot. Great shot from there. Swear to God, I, yeah, must have. Well, Rick was actually in the penalty. That was somebody else's ball that was up there. So he is going to be hitting three from here. Run out. Not a bad on. There's Rick. Oh, all right. That was not the best played hole that we had. Um, we both ended up having penalties, got on the green, and then two putted. We missed the last putt that I had, but we have halved the hole there, so I'm still one up. We got one to play. Let's see what happens. All right, so we are on the last hole of our five hole match. I currently have a one up lead on Rick. Um, we're all scored the last hole. So this is the last chance that he has to catch me. So I can either seal the deal here with a, with a push or he can win it and we'll finish the round with a tie. This is a beautiful par four. Dog leg right there is water down to the right hand side. So we're just gonna try to hit one down there out to the right hand side of the fairway. See what happens. What are you I'm, thinking? I'm coming at him with the five wood. Let's go. It opens up over there, though, doesn't it? Nope, it doesn't. Beautiful shot. Oh, yeah. I gotta hit a provisional because I think I'm, I'm not gonna find it. It does open up on the right side, though, doesn't it? Yeah. That should work. Nice shot. So, we're not sure if we're gonna be able to find Rick's first ball. It went a little right, but it does open up over here, so we're gonna take a look. He did hit a provisional just in case. So, let's get down here and see what we can find. So, my ball ended up down here. We actually, we found Rick's ball. He's down, he's in the woods um, on the car path, but he gets to take relief. So, from where I'm sitting, I've got 185, yards to the hole. I'm just gonna try to hit a little draw around these trees and stick it close. I hit that like right off the toe and it didn't really go anywhere so but I'm in front of the green should have a fairly simple chip up. While we we're doing this, Rick punched out, and now he is about to hit his third shot. Good looking ball. Nice shot. Thanks. Get up above that hill. Not good there. Sit right there, yep. Okay. That was not my best attempt. I still have a decent amount of work left for par. Rick has a putt down the hill. So he is out currently. Let's see how close he can put this. Mm. Nice putt. If I miss this but I get it in for five, then I still win, one up, because we have the hole. But if I can three putt it from here, <laughs> then we finish even. I'm just gonna roll this in and seal it out, you know? I like that confidence. Oh man, the last second. All right, he's uh, left himself with about two feet, but I have to make him putt this because that's just how I roll.
Good match, man. <laughs> Good match. Good match. Well, so that about does it. Match today. I win one up versus Rick, but this was a closely fought round. We had a good time. The course out here is beautiful. The fairways are growing in with some nice, fresh rye grass right now. It's beautiful to be out here. If you enjoy this type of content, make sure you like this video, hit the subscribe button, and let us know in the comments if you want to see more stuff like this, more matches, because we're going to be keeping this up all year. And uh, yeah, peace.